Hello guys and girls and welcome back to a new video today. This is my reaction video to Newport County vs Tramie Rivers at Rodney Parade today. After that performance I didn't think Tramie were that good. I didn't think we created much. and I think we just need to create more chances to try and adapt to our team. Um, I thought the team lineup was okay. But we need we didn't make a chance in the first half. We need to create more. We need to step up a lot stronger than like we have done. And obviously in the past few games, obviously when we played the likes of Salford and um, Scunthorpe at home. But yeah, we really need to change that and try and change that so we can win games. So obviously in the first half. Tramway didn't really make any any changes going into the game. But yeah, we really, really, really need to step up and try and score in the first half. But we didn't do that. We conceded early, I think it was early, 25th minute. 25th minute in the game, obviously, of, oh, what's his name? Manny Montfey gave it away. He literally headed it and then it went to... Je Jenna, Je Jenna, Jessa, Jenna, Jessa, whatever his name is, he scored for Newport, and that's what made it 1 0 to Newport County. Um, Tramier didn't have many chances, obviously, just over the bar. Um, no shots on target, or near enough, or first half, didn't create anything, didn't create. To try and go attacking but yeah um that's just the way we played today which i thought we were terrible in the first half personally i thought um newport was a bit of a pushy bent pushy trying to get everything that they want from the referee obviously getting free kicks what they got um and the referee was awful shocking shite so yeah it's just one of them referees that we got. Anthony Coggins, whatever his name is. Arsehole prick. But yeah. Um and then we just we just slipped a bit. And then obviously going into second half for the game. Um Tron Rose get a, a sending off from Paul Lewis, which I don't think it was a red card. He literally went in for the tackle and tried to win the ball, which I don't think he did, but it wasn't a red. It was not a red. Never a red in a million years. But yeah, so that's we've got to, we've got to miss him for next game. Next three games I think that is um Lane Orient um South End and Crawley, I think it is. Uh, I think it's Crawley away. So we're going to be missing them. He's going to miss them three games. But throughout the game, Tromi had the free kick in the late, I think it was the late 10 minutes, um, getting a free kick. Um, Feeney just hoofed the ball over the bar, which I thought was a disaster because it was a, a shocking free kick. And then, um, Manny Montfey nearly made it, made it an own goal error by heading it, and then obviously one of the tram players claimed the ball off the line, and then obviously Joe Murphy had a great save to make. Obviously, uh, Tristan Abraham should have scored to make it two 0 to Newport, but that didn't happen. But yeah, um. I'm not happy with the result. Obviously, Newport cheating and all that, trying to get everything from the referee, and it worked for them. And it didn't really work for us because we had no shots on target, which I thought is a disaster. But are we going to be doing that next week when we play? Well, next Tuesday when we play, um, Leighton Orient at home. I, just, I really hope we win the game. We have to win next Tuesday, and it's a must-win game, definitely. We need to win, get back 
to try and get him wins now. And then maybe if it's going to be a draw, it's going to be a draw. But we need to start winning games now. Because it's going to get that to that time where if you're in the bottom half and you're struggling to try and stay up, time's going to tell. And then obviously, will that be second manager? But obviously, I'm not going to say second manager just yet. We've got to give them more time, more games. And just see how we adapt with them, the team that we've got. We, we've got a decent team, but we just need to know the right um, team we're going to put out every and each week. So, going into Leighton Orient on Tuesday, which is a massive game for Tramier at home at Prenton Park. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So, this is my video finishing. So, Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe for new. So for next time, I will see you guys maybe Monday or tomorrow for my preview for um, uh, Leighton Orient at home. So yeah, it's going to be our seventh game of the season. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little um, video. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So peace out of the whites and keep on dreaming. Well, keep on dreaming, keep believing. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe.